Okay. I'm here and it's a video. Be grateful for that. I am. I've got a computer that works. I've missed everybody. I've missed making videos. I want to get back to the way it was. Still having problems with the computer. But I won't. I won't. I'll keep this short because it'll probably cut. Videos just seem to stop. I don't know what it is. I did have a Christmas. I hope everybody had a good one. I had a really. I was on my own uh, and I just spoke to people on the internet. So it was a pretty secular Christmas, if you know what I mean. But I did get a gift and it arrived. And my God, it was an, an amazing gift. And I want to thank Richie. Richie Gyrus, I'm sure those who know him know him and those who don't should go and see his channel. Gyrus, rather good modeler and a wonderful gentleman. Thanks Richie, thank you man. I'll start with what he sent me. He sent me that, which is just a lovely old kit. I'm not going to go too much into detail just so I can get this video made. And I'll try and keep the pace. And if it does cut off, it cuts off. And I'll just have to do it again. And I'll do it until I get this video out. Another is a beauty. I do, I do love that machine. The Jag Panther is something to behold, really. I've always been a, a fan of the Jag Panther. But uh, 170 second Jag Panther, lovely stuff. And then. Aaron, Aaron Newlands of, knows what this is, and many of you might. Sci-fi is all new to me, but I'm catching up. I'm, I'm watching the series and stuff. So that was another one, and this is an oddity. <laughs> That's just I've, I've already done my um, Gundam, and I, I like Gundam figures now. I like the idea of those things. You can do what you want with them. You don't have to paint them any particular way, which is cool. And building them is quite fun as well, I realised. You don't even need glue most of the time, which I thought was an added bonus. And anyway, I'll get to the one that is... This is going to be done for a weekend build. I've made a deal with uh, Aaron. And uh, because it says weekend... Ooh, <laughs> it, says <laughs> it says weekend there. I'm not going to be able to start it because it's Thursday. <laughs> so I'll wait till well m midnight Friday I am starting that and let's see what happens with that okay but generally it seems like I will be doing um, biplanes you know, I do like biplanes and uh, I've built most of everything else in the world and I'm, I'm looking for different kinds of models to build all the time but but biplanes are just new, unusual for me anyway I have done the um Atomic Dog. Brian, I'll never thank you enough for this. I did do the SEA5, which I still have to, um, I still have to string up. But, uh, I'm, I'm a blatant coward, but I will. Because I received this. This kit is actually one year older than I am. This is a year older than I am. 19, or oh, whatever, I can't remember details like that. But it's a beautiful, beautiful kit. Way, the way kits used to be made. There's holes for the... There's even... You, you actually, as you're building it, you feed all the... The, st the strings provided, you feed all the, the, the string through, and once you've built it, then you finally just attach all the strings to the relevant points. And it's it's so it's so nice a kit and and I was I was astonished at the size. It's huge. It's I mean just going by that wingspan, you can see I'm I'm up for a really good fun build. Um, and then uh, another one. <laughs> so keeping on the biplane theme, I have the good old matchbox fairy swordfish. I'm a massive fan of uh, Matchbox. When I was a kid, I used to steal them from Woolworths all the time. <laughs> it's true, though. And and to top it off, to make it even more fun. I mean, this just is a weird one. 
Um, he, you can actually see what he wrote on here, but it's a bit obscure, but this is what it is. It's a lighthouse. It's a lighthouse that comes out in pressed paper. And it comes with a toothpick for the glue, and it comes with cellophane for the windows. You know, it's all pre-cut, so it's just a matter of assembly. So that is going to be a bit of fun as well. I, you know, New Year, got to get back into modelling somehow. Can't do the stooky yet, still too cold outside. But as you can see, I've got models to build. So there you go, Brian. Um, and also, he included masking fluid. These are things I just haven't been able to afford, to be honest. And he's been listening to what I've said. And various acrylics. Now, these are just ordinary acrylics that you would buy. And I'm not going to be spraying them. So I'm not going to go into the debate whether they're just ordinary, ordinary domestic acrylic is better than the, the stuff you can buy for proper spray paints and stuff. I actually think I don't think anything about that because I don't have an opinion because I haven't got a, an airbrush. I will make my own judgments when I get an airbrush. But according to some people, you, you can just you can buy these from art shops for half the price of what you can buy the other stuff for the so-called professional stuff. But yeah, you know, blue and green. I think I've got I've got the basic colours. Yeah. Hmm. I've got the basic colours for the, um, the the camel, the sock with camel, which is good. So I am actually set to build now. The I think the weekend build is going to have to be the first. As much as I want to build the sock with camel, but at the same time I don't want to build the sock with camel because it's so old. It's like I don't know. It's like me. I'm old. I don't want to be rebuilt. I don't want to be built at all. Never mind. It scratch. You didn't hear any of what I just said then. And the, the final thing, which I thought was brilliant, was that. Now, I sat here for ages, and my alarm decides to go off on my phone. Awesome. Brilliant. I've never heard of this stuff. Well, I've heard of cement. It's obviously glue. I've heard of this stuff. But I've never, ever known about... Oh, I could... You call people paint sniffers. I could actually sit and sniff that all day. It smells beautiful. It's orange. It's, it feels like you could drink it. You know, like a bolt of orange juice. Probably not a good idea. Or suggest Kids, don't try that at home. Kieran, if you're listening, that's a no-no. Don't don't glug anything that's in one of these containers, even if it's got lemon on the front of it. But there you go. I have got some rather nice kits, and my video hasn't stopped recording yet, which is another th stunning thing. Still having computer problems, but yes. So. All the, all, all the work I've got is still un, in in progress, but you know I said to Aaron I'm going to do this. I need, I need to do something to freshen my mind up and get me back into the modelling. You know after my leg being broken and it's uh, it, it's it's better, but it's you know it's winter, so it's going to get painful soon when it gets really cold. But yeah, I I'm itching to start this. It's it's. It's a beautiful, beautiful kit. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to try my hardest to get back to modelling this year. I really need to do that. I'm sort of, I lost a lot of time for very, for quite a lot of reasons. Um, and, uh, so there you go, I'm back. Um, Gil. And the gang, I hope you were all okay. I'm sorry if I've not been in the hangout. Computer issues. I've been trying to phone the computer shop all morning to no avail. I'll try 
I'll try again in a minute. But uh, yeah, I'm being told I'm. It's running. It, it's keeps saying I'm running counterfeit software, which isn't right because it was. It came from the computer shop. Unless unless they're a fly by night outfit, which they're not. But you know that would be the case. But yeah. Look at all the lovelies I've got. So this actually made my Christmas. I didn't have much of a Christmas. I was on my own with a bottle of scotch and a load of joints and f tons of food I've eaten I've eaten like a king and I've, I've you know spent plenty of time with Erin and, and a few other people on the internet John my friend John in America John Threat what a great name Threat <laughs> you know when you've been threatened Um. yeah but each one of these kits is a little delight in its own and I'm so looking forward to doing them which it, it's good because it's 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 um reinvigorated my urge to model I really had lost my mojo as I keep saying whenever I'm writing or typing or ever whatever but yeah so I'm, wor I'm moving into the world of acrylics hand paint to start just to get used to the medium Hopefully I'll be able to start spraying at some point this year, I'm, I, I'm aiming for. Um, and I've got things to do, I've got plenty to finish off. So in the modelling, on the modelling side of things, everything's good with me. Um, next step is get a haircut. It's driving me, look, look I'm even getting, I'm getting scalp problems because I haven't seen sunlight properly for so long because of this broken leg of mine so getting outdoors is going to be one priority and getting lots of modeling done is the second priority I don't have many other priorities really <laughs> um, yeah the best I can say right now is I hope everybody's okay I'm sorry for being absent so long UK scale modeler I want to say thank you to him as well because he's been great he's trying to help me as much as he can and I do get them being intermittent with the use of the computer is a difficulty because I don't know whether I'm getting messages and then all of a sudden I get inundated with stuff and that's it then when I go to reply I can't reply because the damn thing's broken so when I finally get all of this computer sort of crap sorted out I've got the other one over there to still get sorted out this is this is a new laptop and I'm still getting trouble for, from it um, I'll try and get my channel up and running back to normal making my old videos about dustbins and whatever I can muster and what I used to do I'll just try and get back to myself but, um, I do watch all, all you guys videos I might not comment as much but that's just that's a mood thing you know I'm watching I just can't be bothered typing most of the time but yeah look out for, I'm, I'm gonna make updates of this I'll be writing I'll be writing in the magazine for those who know you'll you'll sort of be able to follow my progress in the magazine the awesome market magazine that Aaron is uh, creating it's created already people have you know it's there um, but um, I'll be right I'll, I'll write an article about this BF and my escapades with this over the weekend I've already written my um, my initial thoughts uh, I'm not going to edit this video I'm just going to leave this as it is because it's coming off the top of my head so it's all you're getting all all my information is being delivered to you at once I've probably got about 30 seconds now so you guys are the best modeling is still a cool hobby and it always will be and uh, I hope to talk to every anyone or everyone whenever I get the chance Gil Aaron Rob basic modeling you got me back into this thing all those years ago and I love you like a brother dude I'll send you a train <laughs> oh by the way Gil do you want to do you want to play train station on Facebook 
<laughs> I'm out. See you guys.